Hello and welcome to Retro to Metro Reactions. You are here with Charlene and I'm very excited because um, I only just found out a couple of days ago that ABBA has a new song and it's called Don't Shut Me Down. Now, clearly I have been living under a rock because when I opened the video, it said it was two years old. So, um, Anyways, I'm excited. Um, I didn't really like ABBA that much when they were out, um, but I really started to uh, like them probably in my 30s um, and now. Uh, so anyways, don't shut me down. I don't know what to expect. They're a completely different band. Well, it's the same people, but I'm sure they're completely different. So let's see let's see uh how it sounds or or what we get anyways blah, blah, blah. don't forget to like and subscribe if you like this video and let's go a while ago i heard the sound of children's love oh joy why does it keep doing this a while ago i heard the sound of children's laughter no it's quiet so i guess they left the park this wooden bench is getting harder by the hour The sun is going down, it's getting dark I realize I'm cold, the rain begins to pour As I watch the windows on the second floor The lights are on, it's time to go It's time at last to let him know Okay, um, so it still sounds like them, uh, but I'm actually finding it a little emotional to listen to it because, um, I mean, it's clear that they're saying, I, well, I mean, I shouldn't say it's clear. For me, it sounds like, um, she's like apologizing for leaving or breaking up the band and she just couldn't handle it at that time at that age um and now she's older and she's the same person but different and she wants to see if this will work either a, a reconciliation of their relationship or more likely probably a reconciliation of the band um but that's what i'm getting from it and it sounds it sounds like them but yeah more mature so anyways um she's fired i love this it's making me emotional okay uh let's keep going
Um, I mean, the, they were married, they had a, a life together and, you know, when a relationship breaks up when you're young and it can be, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> um, dramatic. Um, and then after getting older and reflecting and um, the things that seemed like they were bad or um, unbearable are just, you know, life and normal relationship struggles and growing, um, just growing as people and some stick it out and some break up and sometimes it's dramatic and sometimes it's not but it just sounds like she's saying let's let's do this again and i'm more mature now and i'm not the same person i was even though she still is um anyways um yeah that was really I don't know why it just really resonated with me and uh yeah i liked it i liked it a lot and i wonder if as a real as as couples because there were both couples uh two couples um i wonder if any of them got back together or or didn't i'll have to look that up afterwards or let me know in the comments like i said this was two years ago i don't know how i didn't hear about this Anyways, um, yeah, so thank you very much for being here. And um, I just want to say to my subscribers and my uh, Patreon family, thank you very much for your support. It's, it's beyond comprehension um, that I have over 7,000 subscribers. I know that's not a lot to people who have hundreds of thousands. Um, yeah, but for me, that's a huge deal. So thank you very much. And yeah, um, if you'd like to see anything more like this, please let me know in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will catch you on the flip side. Take care.